My name is Karen Kelleher, and I am a registered nurse. I'm here to tell you about a job that defined my career. It was a job that I almost didn't take. It was one that I thought would be a complete waste of time, one that I wasn't even going to consider. It ended up being the best possible position I could have asked for, and I'm here to tell you why. As a new graduate, I went into the hospital setting, wanted a job in the OR, the ER. Blood and guts, open heart, bring it on, I'm your girl. <laughs> and so I was surprised when a nurse recruiter called me and said, I've got a great job for you. In fact, I didn't even call her back. She was quite persistent. She said, consider this job. It was at a dermatology office. Yay, popping pimples. Four years of college education, $30,000 later, that's what I was going to do. But there was an upside. Weekends were free. No call, 9 to 5. I said, hmm, I'm young. I need my nightlife. So I decided to take the position. And I was in for a big surprise. Not only was it a dermatology office, it was one of the largest dermatology offices in the southeast. It had a three-room operating suite attached to it and I was, that did liposuction, hair transplants, scalp reductions, eyelid surgery, wrinkle removal. This was cutting edge technology. This was way before anybody was doing it. So after working on the floor six months, shadowing a doctor, learning how to pre-op recover, circulate cases in the ORE, I even was able to assist in these cases. I was getting experience I couldn't have dreamed of. The position came open to run the surgery center. I said, I'm your girl. They said, Karen, you're 24 years old. You have no experience. You don't know how to run an OR. You only know what we taught you. I said, give me a chance. Six weeks. If I don't do the job, I'll step back. We'll find somebody else who can do it. And by the way, gentlemen, I'm cheap. <laughs> you don't have to pay big bucks. Mm -hmm. Give me a shot. So they did. Three years later, I'm happy to say that I was extremely successful in the position. We got through a multitude of state accreditations. I was able to formulate relationships with manufacturer reps. I was able to generate revenue and cut costs. I was very happy. When they decided to open a laser center, I jumped at the chance. I said, gentlemen, please consider me. Because I had had success, they said, sure, no problem. It ended up being the largest laser in the southeast. People traveled from a multitude of states to come to that center. They were doing procedures, tattoo removal, before you even heard about doing it with a laser. They were one of the founders of that procedure. Red spots, brown spots, wrinkle removal. We did port wine stain removal, hemangioma removal. We changed people's lives. People had disfiguring birthmarks on their faces, saved up every penny to go to this place, and we were able to touch people's lives. It was a truly wonderful experience, and I was so happy to be a part of it. In the end, I've learned that you can't prejudge a situation. I thought the job would be of no benefit to me. It became exactly what I asked for. I learned in five years what it would have taken one of my colleagues 10 in a hospital. I still got the OR experience. I got the blood and guts, just not the way I thought I was going to. Mm -hmm. This experience taught me a great lesson. When an opportunity presents itself, it's what you do with it that matters. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, everybody read a little note. Awesome, awesome mice.